Hey, hey, fellas, what's poppin'? Roblox Giant here, and today we're gonna be talking about the top 12 new Roblox Spider-Man games to play. Time to play as your favorite web-slinging, web-shooting, friendly neighborhood superhero, Spider-Man. And for the question for this week, what's the name of the recently released Spider-Man movie which features star actors such as Tom Holland, Andrew Garfield, and Tobey Maguire? The answer is somewhere hidden in this video. You know the drill, just comment what is the answer and get your comment liked and pinned. Alright, let's go. Spider-Man Simulator Criminals and villains have escaped into the streets of Roblox City. Fight as Spider-Man in Spider-Man Simulator. At the beginning of the game, you can choose from multiple skins like the OG Spider-Man, Miles Morales, the Rain Suit, Far From Home, and many more. Some need to be purchased though. You can double jump in the game and the player moves somewhat really fast. There are lots of items like Spider-Man's web, Spider-Bots that search out and damage enemies, and even Captain America's shield. There are multiple hostile NPCs that you can fight from common criminals to even Thanos himself. The goal of this game is to defeat as many hostile NPCs as possible. The buildings in this game are pretty simple in design, the maps are also pretty small in size. The game is relatively easy to grasp and play, as well as it is easy to learn. Swing in Spider-Man the game showcase is a nice Spider-Man web swinging system. If you're into that kind of thing, be sure to check this game out. The main focus of this game is web slinging mechanics. You can press E or Q to cast web onto buildings. The web mechanic and swinging mechanic actually works pretty well as the web attaches to the building. You can climb and run on walls, just like the real Spider-Man. The game really makes you feel like Spider-Man or something. If you've played Just Cause 3 or anything remotely close to web slinging action, then it's something similar. The costume in the game is your default skin. The buildings in this game are really tall, which helps you highlight the web slinging mechanic of this game. Christmas Typical Web Swinging Game Typical Web Swinging Game is your typical Roblox Spider-Man game. No need for fancy animations and all that stuff. Pretty much everything in this game is ready for you to explore and use the moment you step foot into it. The game also has PvP in it. You can turn on PvP mode on the tab on the side of the screen to fight with other players who also have their PvP turned on. The in-game animations are pretty well made. The web slinging and fighting animations are really expressive. The camera even moves dynamically at times. You can fight NPCs in this game as well and do missions that are marked in the game. The combat in this game is pretty dynamic, pretty fun, and don't forget, it's Spider-Man. The map in this game is also large in scale, and there's a lot to explore. Overall, this game looks really nice. I really think this game is a nice way to waste your time and have fun while doing so. Free VIP Spider-Man Simulator Welcome to the Spider-Man Simulator. Can you become the strongest Spider-Man? Well, I know I can, but can you? In this game, you get chased around by an evil Spider-Man and Venom. Wait, really? Evil Spider-Man? Anyways, the goal is to survive as long as you can. There are multiple morphs available in this game to help you customize your character. Somehow, even the imposter and crewmate from Among Us is here. Also, there are some items that help you survive, like the speed coil, flying cloud, a gun, rainbow carpet, etc. The map is pretty simple and small, with only a few structures present, so there's not much to explore. Spider-Man Life Take a leap forward and become like Spider-Man and pretty much live his life or something. Spider-Man Life It's a game that seems to be pretty under development as the mechanics are still wonky. You can sling webs, young the queue, and E keys so that you can also damage enemies using your webs. You can also fight various NPCs like criminals and even Venom. The buildings in the map have realistic textures and are very big which makes the game enjoyable to swing using your webs. The map gets a bit glitchy at times though. I hope this improves for the future. Be Spider-Man In this game you can be Spider-Man. Haha, <laughs> get it. No, of course not. You haven't played the game yet. You can also press Q to perform combat moves. Pretty easy, right? If you press space and click, it launches you in the air like Spider-Man. You can also use your mouse to sling your web. The game itself has a pretty decent combat and slinging animations. The map also appears to be pretty outdated, but the details and structures are still fun to explore. You can also fight thug NPCs in this game. That's it. In Visions Webverse This game has very complex controls and a lot of different moves. You can do just like web zip, web blast, web swing, and web strike, and many more. 
The game also has in-game events like boss fights that you can fight bosses like Sandman. Webverse is clearly under beta, but the map and the gameplay are pretty smooth. Just a small issue is the controls that are a bit complex and overwhelming at times. There are a few unlocked costumes at the start of the game. The PS4 Spider-Man suit, the 2002 Human Spider suit, and the Homecoming suit. Infinite 2 Spider-Man Swinging Test The only feature in this game is the web slinging feature, which you basically explore the map while swinging. The map is fairly large in size, which gives a lot to explore for the player, and the only available skin is the Miles Morales Spider-Man skin. Spider-Man Unlimited In this game you do quests given by NPCs from simple tasks like fetching items, to fighting bosses like Venom and Carnage. There are a lot of unlockable costumes, even Venom, and Carnage can be unlocked by the spider coins you collect while exploring the map and doing quests. The map design has its own cartoonish style, akin to that of a comic book. There are a lot of familiar locations like Spider-Man's apartment, the Daily Bugle, and Central Park. Spider-Man Tycoon This game has a traditional tycoon gameplay. You upgrade your tycoon to generate more money and unlock items. The items are spider-themed, like a web-slinger, a spider-bot, a spider-motorcycle, and a spider-sword. There's no PvP allowed, so no other players will be able to bother you while you upgrade your tycoon. Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse For me, this one is pretty weird. You basically fight axe-wielding zombies using guns, but you are wearing the Miles Morales spider suit. The map is fairly simple, and you can enter most buildings, so I guess it's pretty fun to explore. Also, there's no goal. You just kill zombies for fun in this game. And you're Spider-Man. That's it. Escape Spider-Man Obby Parkour Escape Spider-Man Obby Parkour is a parkour game that has Spider-Man themes. Well, we're talking about Spider-Man games. Obviously, it's going to be centered around the Spidey Boy. There are various Spider-Man references present in the Obby. Movie posters are also present too. The courses are pretty easy to do if you are a seasoned parkour veteran, but it's still very fun as an experience. There's also a major surprise at the end of the obby. So yeah, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon. Likes and comments are highly appreciated. Don't forget to answer this week's question to get your comment liked and pinned. Alright, Roblox Giant, at your service. Thank you for supporting and watching our videos.